Good morning, everybody. Welcome to another episode of Pokemon. My name's DeadM5337, and we have just got done with the, well, the longest freaking battle we've had. All right. What is it? Did you already beat all the baddies without me? Okay, out with it, you. Who are you, really? Thank you for everything. The time machine has finally, she has finally been stopped. You're really not my mom, are you? Oh, look how big you've grown. So proud of my... Sorry you were alone so long, Arve. Mom? Security system failure. Security system failure. Threat to time machine detected. Threat to time machine detected. Whoa! What's going on now? It's another army of Pokemon on its way here? It cannot be. An obstacle is preventing the time machine from performing as intended. Activating a paradise protection protocol in removing offensive. Ah, what was keeping the time machine running truly all this time? Locking all Pokeballs except those registered from SATA's ID. Wait, what? Programming initializing terrestrial. I'm sorry, children. This is too much for you. You must run. AI SATA disabled. Paradise Protection Protocol activated. You are number seven getting away. You challenged by AI SATA. You challenged by Par Paradise Protection Protocol. Paradise Protection Protocol sent out Cordon. Cannot battle without Pokemon on the field. True, our Pokemons won't work. How are we even supposed to battle? Swap in. Welcome to the programmed fight. Oh, by the way, uh, let's go and fix this while we're still uh, loading things. Uh, all right. Boop, boop. Doot, doot. All right. Okay. It went Super Saiyan. Gar rar Sunlight turned harsh. The opposing cordon turned harsh in the sunlight. Cordon based sunlight sending something something who cares. <sighs> Colin course. Use taunt. Collision course. Uh, 
It changed its battle form. Let's go, Corridon. You got this. Battle. Uh, Terror Blast. Flamethrower. Let's go, Flamethrower. You will fail here within the Garden Paradise. Achieve nothing in end. Not very effective. Battle. Terror Blast. You will not be allowed to destroy the paradise. Obstacles to my goals will be blah blah. And he's got bulk up. Oof. And I've got a terrible move called Endure. Well, that is completely useless. So like I said, it could be bad. Uh, hang on in there, dead M. All right, uh, collision course. Data says that I'm superior. Fail and become a foundation upon which Giga Impact. Corridor on top it out. Collision course. You took the hit like a champ. You can do this. I know you can. Attack Rose. Great. Uh, bag. I think we're supposed to be at one hit point, but whatever. I am cheating. Oh, man. Really pull off a win here. Let's go. Hey, your terror over is glowing. About frickin' time. Cordon crystallize. Finish this thing off. Ah, second attack rose. Defense rose. Special attack rose. Good job. Special defense rose. Good job. All right. And speed rose. Great. Battle. Terrestrialize. Terror Blast. About time we go ahead and have a dragon move. Wow, 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 wow. Cordon use Terror Blast. Super effective. Flamethrower. Not very effective. Show them you won't be pushed around. Time to trust eyes and get the super effective hits. Battle, one more Terror Blast. Is a scheduled thing because I did a heal as opposed to attacking. Uh, it didn't take him out. You defeated a paradise protocol protection. You did it! It's not going berserk anymore. Oh, wait. Before that goes on, let me go and click on this thing on my computer. And we're going to start that. And we're going to... We're going to turn off uh, audio from them. Won't go berserk anymore. How? <clears throat> How very astonishing to think that you would manage to defy even the original professor's final protections. Are you back to normal? 
Yes, completely unforeseen outcome, even for an AI processing, the most sophisticated technology ever conceived. Even on the brink of despair, you children did not give in, instead proved your worthiness. Show the wisdom to think of yourselves, the courage to hold faith in your hands, the fortitude to do what had to be done. No matter how difficult your own past may have been. I believe you will be capable of walking whatever path you choose for yourselves with pride. Thank you, Dead M5337. Thank you, all of your children. But I'm afraid that this time machine cannot be put to complete stop as long as I am here. It appears I myself am part of the system that ensures the time machine reboots when stopped. What does that mean? I am sorry. You know, when I was watching you all, your adventures from down here, I felt a sense of jealousy. I envied your freedom. The way you came together working in the League with your followers and caring for them. The way you sought strength and to better yourselves, showing all of you are into your battles the way that you would face down even the greatest enemies to save that which you loved the way you never ceased to seek nor to fight for a treasure all your own ah, rah, rah. ah and the way you soared free through the very skies on those wings of yours i wish that i too might be free as you all, free to seek out which I might treasure, above all else, not bound. Your own treasure? As long as I remain here, this time machine will not stop. I am an ex inextricably connected to it. So I've made a decision. I will use the machine to journey to the world of the ancient past that I've dreamed of. What? You can't just leave now, right when we finally reached you. I am not going only so that the time machine can be stopped. I also cannot deny my desire to see the ancient world myself. Is this what it feels like to have your heart race with the thrill of adventure? Avon, I am so sorry I could have kept the truth for you so long. I inherited all the thoughts and wishes of the professor. And so I understand better than any. Your mother truly loved you. You, you can't. You can't just go and say a thing like that now. No, I suppose you're right. I'm sorry. Yeah, because it's rude as hell. Avon, Corridon, Dead M. It is a little sad, but I'm afraid this is goodbye. Mom. Farewell, my free adventures. I bid you adieu. It's a little annoying she takes the book with her. Uh, part of the reason why I'm playing uh, the 1812 Overture, I mean, other than it rocks, is because I do know during the credit scenes they go and play a music song that is copyrighted. And I am not getting hit by the copyright strike. Uh, how could you just go, Mom? Avon, it's okay, bud. Yeah, somewhere deep down, I kind of already knew it. I knew that thing was a fake, but it... When, I, when it said my name, using her voice and wearing her face, even if it was fake, it felt real, you know? It's, and so I just... 
I... Sorry, I don't know what I'm saying. Uh, that's okay. <laughs> Gareth! I guess Cordon's sad too. But that battle form, how cool is that? It's so strong. If it tries to nudge me uh, for belly rub while it's huge like this, I seriously think I'm going to die. Hey, let's not skip over the big win here. Dead M5337 and Cordon just saved us all. Of, uh, saved all of Paldea. That's right. You both did amazing. Thanks, Dead M. Yeah, that's my bud Dead M for you. You know, Avon, um, even though the professor is gone, I bet she's finally having a real fun adventure of her own in the past. Yeah, thanks, Penny. Um, yeah, sorry. So what should we do now, Dead M? Let's go home. You said it. Come on, everyone. Let's make our way home. Alright. And then they go and load. I'm sure they're getting ready to load the cre the end credits. Okay, everybody, listen up. What is it? Let's take the long road. A little more fun out in the adventure. I don't really... Sounds great. We should load up on snacks first. I'm in. Dead M, not you too. Meh. Meh. All right, fine. I guess we're doing this. I mean, you got all that camping gear. Might as well put it to use. All right. And here's the ending credits. No music's playing, so they can't copyright me. Nice. Hope you all enjoyed yourselves. Please be sure to go and like, comment, subscribe. This is my last run of this uh, version of Pokemon. I think probably for a while. So, if you guys enjoyed it, please be sure to go and uh, stick around and watch something else. Um, I have no idea why, but uh, Lucky Hunter has been just popular as all heck I, I I can't believe uh how many views I'm getting on that so if you are going in uh watching Pokemon be sure to go and check out Lucky Hunter um I think we'll go back to adding uh Die in the Dungeon back to our uh playlist so if you enjoyed that too that'd be awesome but uh, I I just want to say uh, a special thanks to all you guys who actually did watch, did stick around. I know this is a uh, long run, and well, frankly, it it does th this. This version of Pokemon does drag a little bit on a little bit too hard. Uh, I think next time I play, I'm going to play uh, like Sword and Shield. But I, I, I think we're going to take a break from Pokemon for at least a little bit. Um, 
I'm up to a whopping 76 subscribers. So uh, if if you're watching this and you haven't subscribed yet, please, please, I, I know I'm joking, but I, I do like watching that number go up. Um, it, I, I'm not making any money from this. This is just kind of fun for me. I... I am... I'm just excited that I'm entertaining some people. Um, I, I hope uh, I keep entertaining you guys for some time. But that being said, that that's it. So I'm going to let the music play and we're going to let the credits roll. And if you guys want to head out now, feel free. If you want to stick around till the end of the credits, I'll greatly appreciate it. Just, I'm, I'm just kind of overwhelmed by the fact that people are starting to watch my stuff I'm uh, I'm glad that uh, it started by the uh, you know towards the end of this because it's given me an opportunity to uh, say thank you without you know interrupting any sort of game or you know being in the middle of something that's, you know, nobody wants to go and hear me say thank you to. <clears throat> um, yeah. So, uh, poo. Thank you, treasured friends. The end. Well, ding dong. Calling students to the director's office. Master Dead M, Master Nimona, Master Aben, and Miss Penny. Director Carvel would like to see you in his office. Ding dong. All right, we'll check out the little post credits. Ha, looks like the hero's finally here. Would you join us, Master Dead M? Ah, uh, we're in for an earful, aren't we? I guess we'll find out soon enough. No need to concern you two. I'm not angry in the slightest. I merely called you here to discuss the fine achievements of this year's treasure hunt. You shut down the Professor's time machine and thus prevented ancient Pokemon from running rampant across Paldea. Your actions are truly outstanding. Every regard I could have couldn't be prouder of all. Though your decisions to enter the a strictly off limits area was admittedly admittedly regrettable. <laughs> you got us there. However, since it was necessary to protect Paldea and its precious ecosystem, I am willing to overlook that particular point. Whew. So we're not getting raked over the coals after all. Oh, but before I forget, Master Dedem, there's still something I would like you to have. Each of your friends have received one already. 
So this one is for you. Obtaining a Master Ball. Put a Master Ball in your pocket. The very best Pokeball with the ultimate level of performance. With it, you can catch any wild Pokemon without fail. Oh, about the Hall of Fame badge I gave you a short while ago, the gift is one we bestow only upon students who have received truly remarkable feats. I expect you to honor what that badge represents by striving ways to severe serve as a model for your fellow students. You can count on me. Splendid. Such enthusiasm will surely take you far in life. And Master Avon, I'm so sorry to hear about the professor. You have my deepest consolences. Ah, well. Yeah, it was pretty rough when I found out my mom had died. But weirdly enough, my head actually feels clear now. For the first time in ages. In the Great Crater, I got to learn a bit about my mom's research and what she was trying to achieve down there. I guess... If you're building something as mind-blowing as a time machine, that takes priority over showing your son some attention, huh? All I know is I'm done feeling like <laughs> some lost little kid. Done. Time to say goodbye and move on. I'm going to enjoy every last day till graduation with my buds and my bastiff. Bastiff. Of course. Well said, Master Haven. You truly are your mother's son. Of course, I must remind you that you've nowhere near enough credits to graduate. You'll need to study frantically to catch up, but I have every expectation of your success. What? Bah! And let us not forget the other good news. Our academy has a new champion. Though we sadly cannot make your valiant deed in the great crater known to the public. Your new champion rank will at least, at least should be celebrated throughout the whole school. Oh, I know how we should celebrate. We should hold Pokemon Battle Contest. Seriously, could we not? Classic Nimona. A Pokemon battle contest, you say? While your own vested interest is such a venture are more than apparent, Miss Nimona. I think it's a fine idea. But please understand that a large-scale event will be quite beyond us, and many other school activities to keep an eye on, after all. Pardon my intrusion, I couldn't help but over here. The Pokemon League will of course happily lend a hand in organizing this contest. Le Prima! Well, well, a most kind offer, offer, Chairwoman Greta. I do everything in my power to nature young up-and-coming talent, though that is not to say only the youth have promise when it comes to Pokemon battle. A former gym leader, the developer of a Pokedex app, this academy clearly counts many skilled trainers of Pokemon amongst the staff. As such, my suggestion is as follows. Students and staff should compete for the title of the strongest trainer at the academy. Whoa! We'd be battling the teachers? You'd compete too, La Prima? Is that even allowed? A chairwoman not part of the academy, right? Actually, I think she's the chairwoman of the school board, as well as the Pokemon League. Wait, for real? I mean, I knew she was another level, but wow! Uh, thank you for the invitation, Champion Nimona. I would gladly take up a kind offer to compete alongside you all, but I'm afraid my schedule is already packed tight with work that I simply must attend to. Aw, can't you free up some time 
somehow? Well, I suppose I might be able to participate if Champion Dead M would agree to lend me a hand with my work. Where should I start? Excellent answer. Much advised, Champion. To get straight to it, I would like you to go out and inspect Peltia's various gems in my stead. They are fulfilling their duties as beacons of strength and inspiration to all those aiming to achieve champion rank. Or has their abilities started to fade? To find this out, I ask you to bring your full might as a champion to bear against each of the gym leaders and test their prowess in battle. They are all trainers of exceptional talent, handpicked by me personally. I do not expect you'll find any cracks in their armor, but well, consider it formally, this will also provide a perfect stage for your first appearance as the new champion, since the gym leaders will still be expecting me to carry out the inspection, I imagine they'll muster their full strength. I dare say they might be more of a challenge than when you faced them before. You get to have all out battles with gym leaders. Man, I'm jealous. Now then, on to another crucial matter. Like to discuss Penny. Here, how to patch the weaknesses in the league point system. Um, but there's a bunch of anime I've missed that I'm just gonna binge. Thank you in advance for your willing and eager cooperation. You know, or jail. Uh, I mean, I'll, I'll do it. I'll, I'll help. Let me help. Excellent. We'll leave you all to it then. Come now, Penny. Uh... This is awesome. Show this inspection thing who's boss so that La Prima can join the tournament, okay? Enjoy taking another swing at the gym gauntlet while you're at it. I'll take care of filling out forms on the other administrative staff so the ball gets rolling on the tournament in the meantime. I say it's wonderful to see you all showing such initiative. You each have a critical role to play. Penny's assisting the league. Our new chair, chairman inspecting Jim. Champion inspecting gyms. Nomona arranging the event. Give it your best, everyone. I guess my role is obvious. It goes without saying. Yeah, graduate. <laughs> All right. That being said, woohoo. Hope you all enjoyed yourselves. Please be sure to go and like, comment, subscribe. Goodbye.